Hey man, y'all already know what time it is, man. Bull the man back with another video. And in today's video, I'm not gonna waste your time. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get all your hot zones within 10 to 20 minutes, really easy, really quick. If you guys wanna be pulling up, getting these big old garinas, all you gotta do is follow this method. Now, before I start today's video, I gotta give credit where credit is due. Shout out to Swante and shout out to Jo the Don. Their links will be in the description down below. I got this method from both of them. So make sure to go ahead and sub to them and tell them the culture sent you. All right. You probably already subbed to them, but go sub to them if you haven't already. All right. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get all the hot zones quick and easy. As you guys can see, I am currently in my mic court shooting around and I pretty much have every single hot zone area that I need as a shot creator. I don't have the two kind of similar, like around the paint. I don't have those, but I have just about every single one I need in order to shoot the ball consistently, all right? So let's go ahead and hop into it. So the first step you guys are gonna need to do is go play some My Career. Now, what I mean by that is go to your options, click 12 minutes and click pro. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is not just score a whole bunch of points, but you're gonna want a high teammate grade. You're gonna wanna be shooting the ball well, and you're gonna wanna be getting a whole bunch of assists and rebounds. Overall, just play good in My Career. And after those games, it only took me two games to get hot. Now, what you're going to want to do is go to your minutes and you'll see this right here. Look at my name, Coleman. As you guys can see, I have the hot emoji next to my name. You're going to need that 100% and you're also going to need to be a starter. OK, so go play 12 minute quarters, put it on pro. It only took me two games to get this hot little symbol next to my name. You must be a starter. OK, I'm going to repeat myself. You must be a starter. Now, while you are playing those My Career games, getting those assists and rebounds, just know, all right, you have to be shooting the ball consistent. As you guys can see, this is my current shot chart uh, this year in My Career. This is my My Career shot chart. You must be shooting consistently. If you have cold zones, it's not going to work, all right? It's not going to work as good. You still might get hot zones, but this is the best method. Make sure you are shooting consistent and have red zones everywhere. All right, so next, what you're going to want to do is pretty much sim through the end of the regular season. Uh, just sim all the way through, and you're going to want to go into your first playoff game. Now, as you guys can see, I'm just messing around, going into my first playoff game. I won the MVP. You already know what time it is, man. I'm cold, and man, I win those MVPs, baby. Now, as you guys can see, I'm in my first playoff game. And what you're going to want to do, as soon as the ball is tipped off and you have the ball, click pause and sim to end with no VC. Just quit out. All right, that's all you're going to want to do. Load back into the playground. Go to your league stats. Go to minutes. You see, I got the hot symbol. And these are my hot zones for the park right here. This is how you do it. I kept it simple. I kept it plain. This is how you do it. All right. Now I go back into my my court and this is what it looks like currently right now. Like I said, I don't need those two little zones right there. And I'm pretty much satisfied with the amount of hot zones I currently have. I'm only missing two, so that's not that bad. If you guys did not like the results you got, all you have to do is just sim through or not sim through. I would play bad on purpose in the playoff game so you guys can restart another season i know a lot of people uh, sometimes don't get all their hot zones i got fortunate enough to get pretty much all the hot zones i need all the threes all the mid-range areas i got lucky all right so listen man if you guys want to be able to get this i'm going to repeat it one more time the process number one play on 12 minutes on pro all right now you're going to want to play as many games as is possible until you go to your minutes and you see that hot symbol next to your name all right once again you must be a starter all right now once you have those things done and your hot zones in my career are red and you're shooting very consistent then all you have to do is send the rest of the regular season out all the way until playoffs enter your first playoff game and then as soon as it goes to tip off, just exit out, sim to end with no VC, come to the playground and check your hot zones. And if you don't have all, you should have at least most of the hot zones, uh, you know, to be shooting very consistent in the my park. If you guys have any questions, let me know down below in the comment section or feel free to hit me up on Twitter at Witness Cole. All right, hit me up on Twitter. By the way, follow me on Twitter if you haven't already. But that is going to wrap it up for today's video. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to go ahead and drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already enjoyed the culture. I'm going to catch you guys next time. I'm out.